Greetings, everyone, and thank you so much for being here um, on this segment of Business Solutions after 2020 pandemic. We have some good information to drop on you today. Today is Sunday, February 21st, 2021. We're excited to announce our featured business series. We're going to talk about that today. We're also going to welcome our uh, business series hostess. She's a wonderful woman. We're going to give you some information about that. And then we're going to drop you some wisdom jewels on business development um, for this week. Okay, so let's get started. Our feature business series will run beginning March 7, 2021 through March 31st, 2021 as a give back to small business creativity. So we're requesting that creative businesses connect with us to allow us to do a small segment on them. So the community will get to know you and you will be given opportunity to express yourself and practice run to do advertisement for your uh, organization, corporation or business. Okay. Number two. We are welcoming our hostess, Miss Waylon, who is a longtime friend, college, you know, bestie, and we're going to invite her on as a personality to the business um, featured business series, and she's going to really shake things up. She's going to ask the hard hitting questions about business, and it's going to be featured in a fun, loving way. So, subscribe to this channel to get the latest um, on this video beginning 6 p.m. on Sunday, March 7th. And let me see. The final thing is I'm going to drop drop some jewels for you on the business tip. So in this video, I want to share ideas on creativity in business. And I'm going to give you three points to suggest or to advise or to get feedback from you regarding these three ideas. Okay, the first one is you want your idea in business to make money. Do we agree on that? Okay, if we do, selling an idea may not always make sense in the beginning. Some people may sell their idea um, voluntarily. They may give business away. And some people in business don't understand that that makes sense because eventually as you grow, it's you, you are adding momentum to your relationship, your business relationships by allowing people to get in, to get to know you. So doing some things for free at the very beginning is a good way to promote yourself. So as uh, you know, I was speaking with a a business developer uh, uh, the other day, and it was said, well, that makes no sense. Why are you going to do advertisement and, you know, for free? Well, because doing that allows people, again, to get to know you. And that's what this thing is all about, because eventually, as you grow, people are going to invest in your business if your idea can make money. So don't buy into anything that does not residually give it back to you. Okay. Number two, creative creativity means doing it your way. There is nothing new under the sun. We understand that. But there are areas of creativity that keeps a business running on a consistent basis. Like, like I said, I've had to maneuver and move through business in different faucets, in different practices. I had to stop this and start that and try this and mix this with that. And what I found is that duplicating a service that is already around me is not creative. It's just in, it's just another franchise. Okay. It's like having 20, you know, Taco Bells. Okay. It's not really creative. So you don't want to piss off the, the businesses that you're duplicating because they won't work with you. 
So then that puts you, that isolates you. So it's something that you really don't want to do. When you're being creative in business, I understand there's nothing new under the sun, but the way you do it and the spin you put on it makes it different. So focus um, on the goal driving perspective when building a new concept to what you feel you want to invest your money in and put your energy and power into. And finally, be open to the new areas of business uh, communication. Conversation always impacts success. We're going to come to the table, talk about something and learn something tremendously valuable if we are working around wise people, okay? Um, yeah, there's a little bit of ego in every business, but I think it should be a little, it should balance with wisdom equally, okay? Conversations always impact success. So like my hostess and I, we just recently shared a way to get a panel of people to discuss business in a fun, loving way. And that is where we want you to be. We want you to be sitting down talking about those ideas that can drive energy into something that people will say, wow, that's very different. I want to be a part of that. And you know, these are just those fun things. So I hope this has awakened some creative spark in you to begin a business, to continue going on the route of business that you're on. We all have gifts and talents the world can use today. We are shut down as a society right now. So to get us thinking on a new world level is what this is about. And if you would like more information, more suggestions on business ideas, concepts, or planning or proposaling or um, processing organizational structures within the business, please feel free to give me a call. Inbox me at this now, at this video, wherever you see it, and I will get the information. Um, you know, we are becoming new world leaders and innovators. So yeah, this is this is the time. This is the time to take flight. Okay. So let's recap again. Recap again. We have new information coming. We want you to um, meet us on Sundays beginning March the 7th, 6 p.m. You can subscribe to this channel and always get the video that drops as soon as it drops in your email. And we're going to talk about um, our our hostess is going to bring some good, fun energy and vibration to new businesses or, that are out around our community that's doing some good, positive love and, and, and lovely things in our community. And then the wisdom that drops on this video and many other videos after this is going to be a very profound notion of how you can push yourself forward to know that you're not alone in business. There's other people striving and moving to that momentum. So yeah, and I hope the information helped you today and uh, we'll see you next time.